Welcome to the AACS Daily News for September 16th, 2015. September is Childhood Cancer Awareness Month and the Attleboro Police Department is making an effort to spread the message. Attleboro Police Chief Kyle Hegney spoke more about the effort. September is Childhood Cancer Awareness Month and in light of uh, bringing more awareness to childhood cancer, we have a junior police officer that we sworn in named Dylan Berrio. Dylan is suffering from brain tumors, cancerous brain tumors now. So in honor of our junior police officer, Dylan, we attached the child cancer awareness ribbons to every mock cruiser in our fleet. So hopefully we'll bring more awareness to childhood cancer into our community. So if people uh, pull up behind our cruises, they'll be able to see the gold ribbon, gold signifying the childhood cancer awareness color for the month of September. The men and women of this police department come to work every single day and they put their life on the line. They have to be brave. But to see this little boy, Dylan, battle his courageous triumph with cancer, it brings tears to your eyes. He, he is uh, just a wonderful, wonderful child, and it's, it's unfortunate that he's suffering from this grave illness. He brings strength to us for what he endures, for all the chemotherapy. We're so very proud of him and, and, and what he does, just to show us how it is to be truly brave. Even though that we're Attleboro's finest, we're supposed to be the bravest, he truly is remarkable, and he's a hero to us. And this is the least we could do to support him. The Attleboro Animal Shelter has another cat looking for a new home. Friends of the Attleboro Animal Shelter volunteer, Mae Myers, introduced us to her. This is Blizzard. Blizzard's one of our grown-up kitties. I kind of call her a cow kitty. Black and white, medium hair. Gets along well with almost all other animals, um, except for some males who are dominant. She can be a little um, put off if there's a lot of stir going around. Um, but other than that, she's playful, loving, follows you around in the shelter. When people are cleaning, she will follow them. She loves to get her ha head scratched. <laughs> she would be better with a family that had older children um, and adults. Either she could go with a, si a single person, a couple, or a family with older children. A cat like this, you will need to brush at least once a week. Um, you want to make sure that they don't get mats. Um, Blizzard is used to being brushed. We brush her here at least once a week so that uh, she likes it. <laughs> She's very, very cute. If you're interested in Blizzard or any of our other cats that are the animal shelter, all you have to do is to fill out an application, which you can get at the shelter during our visiting hours, which are Wednesday night 6 to 8 and Saturday 11 to 3, Sunday 11 to 1. Or you can go online to fos.org and get a application online. You can either mail that to us or submit it via our website. So it's very, very easy. It does take a couple of days for us to go through the applications and make sure everything is on the application is correct. Um, and then you can find a little bit of love and bring it home. That's it for today's update. For ACS News, I'm Austin Ricketts.